Hi guys, um, today I wanted to talk about um, a Lush product that I received, or a couple of products that I received. Now I had watched Balmain Beauty's um, video on these products and she had ordered some things from there and I was like, yeah, I'd like to try them. I had received one of their products, I think either in a glossy box or a lust have it. It was the green sugar soap that I had received. Um, now it took me a long time to actually try that product. Um, it sort of just sat in my cupboard for months and months and months and then I ended up using it and I actually really enjoyed it. I heard some bad things about it. Some people didn't enjoy the product, but I really did. I only got one wash out of it because it dissolved so quickly, but I, I enjoyed it. That's the sugar soap. So I went on their website and um, I picked up one of their gifts and uh, one of their gift packs and just one of their shower gels. So the gift pack that I had um, bought was the had a shot had a, a very shiny nose and here's the little card that I got with it which um, talks about well tells you the ingredients in which soap now these are um, handmade um, soaps so here's the little box that it come in and I'll go through each soap that I got now each soap is a hundred grams which is a fair amount so the first one is the North Pole Soap. So here it is here. It's very, very pink, which I like. <laughs> and um, I'll just describe the smells, what they are, what they're like to me. So the North Pole Soap uh, reminds me of their candy canes. Um, it's sort of a little bit minty, sweet smelling soap. I might take it out of the pack. And you can, might be able to get a better look at it. So there's the North Pole soap. Now I'm yet to try these ones out, but I wanted to talk about them. So I got that one. I also got the Northern Lights soap. So I'll take this one. This one's really cool as well. Um, just the look of this soap. Ah, if I can get it undone. Okay, so the Northern Light Soap. And this one has a very soapy smell to it. And uh, it's very sort of, it's a bit citrusy. It's sort of a citrus kind of smell. So there it is there. So it's very yellow. And then you've got your sort of an orangey color and then a real green sort of color so I love the look of this soap and it, yeah it does have a very sort of uh, lime smell to it but also very soapy at the same time so I've got that one like I said they're all 100 grams so good sizes and the last one I got in the in the pack is the snow globe soap and I love this one too and this one has um, Sort of a citry uh, sort of smell to it as well. It doesn't smell as soapy as the Northern Lights, but I can't really put my finger on it. I've smelt it before. Like it, this soap actually brings like back a memory for me from when I was like a teenager or something, but I can't really pick what it is. So there it is there, and I love these um, little white bits in it. I don't really know what they are, but. I just love the look of these soaps but this one's really nice as well now you can pick this pack up at, in, at their website and it's around $17 17 or $18 for these three soaps um, and like I said they're handmade soaps so that was the $17 and then I also picked up one of their shower gels now I wanted to get the snow fairy but I couldn't get the snow fairy I wanted it in the smaller size because I haven't tried it before and I wanted to see if I enjoyed it <laughs> so I couldn't get that one so I ended up going for the grass shower gel because I love the smell of fresh cut grass so there it is there and this is the hundred grams as well and this one cost um, about ten dollars as well I'm pretty sure I will definitely put in the exact price for this one because my order all up come to about thirty six dollars something like that so um haven't tried this one yet when I smelt it 
it does have a grass smell to it, but not the type of grass smell that I thought it was going to be. So it smells like weeds more than grass. <laughs> but um, I think when you actually use it in the shower, it's, it's actually going to smell quite nice. So I still actually like the smell of this, but it's not what I thought it was going to be. So really excited to um, try that one as well. And I just noticed a little sticker on the back, which tells you um, who it was made by and when. So there we go. So that's pretty cool. And it says this product was made by Rena on the 27th of the 8th. And then it has the use by date, which is the 27th of the 10th of 2013. So, excited to try these Lush products. Um, like I said, I, I received my first Lush product in um, one of my beauty boxes that I received last, uh, no, it was uh, this year, real early on in the year. Um, oh, and I'll, they also um, had the little box tied up with the ribbon it's like a Christmas ribbon so I decided to use it in my hair because it's Christmas time so <laughs> I thought that was cute so that's what I received from Lush I'm going to be doing a review on the soaps as well but I just wanted to talk about the ones that I that I've just got and um, yeah if I will pick any more up so yeah I'll leave the link to their website go check them out it's vegan as well vegan products and um, yeah, on the little card, it tells you how to use the products as well. So if you're unsure on how to use them and, and things of that nature, you can always check the little cards that they send along. Okay, so um, thanks for watching, guys. And go check out Lush and see what you think. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.